This small zoo is located on 10 acres of land and it's the only zoo in the entire state that's operated by a college. Hi and welcome to Aiken Adventures. Well, we're taking you to do all the best things in all the best places all around Florida. First stop is the capuchin monkeys in the front. You see more monkeys? Yeah, I see a lot of monkeys. And while we were ready to look at all the other animals, Vivian found a playground. So that's what she's really concerned about doing. This section right here houses all of the reptiles. There are several different kinds of turtles and snakes here. And even some frogs. We're off to find the turtles. None of the trails are paved, so it's a little bit more of a challenge to push the stroller. So actually, we are looking at gopher tortoises instead of turtles. Now we're off to see the wild deer. And on the other side, we're gonna look for the alligators. We can't find the alligators. They must be all taking a nap. Okay, I looked, but I can't see the deer anywhere. Up here is a pavilion where you can stand and look out at the trainers while they're training the different birds and ducks. Over here in this enclosure is supposed to be the box turtle. I love that you can see the otters so well. Sometimes that's so challenging at other zoos. The pig back there is hiding and probably taking a nap. He's the smart one. This is a tree kangaroo. I don't think I've ever seen one before. In this enclosure are the East African gray crowned cranes. Unfortunately, they're really hard to see right now. It looks like they've been given a lot of space to roam around. I think all the animals know how hot it is outside because they seem to all be hiding. We found the lemurs. Looks like they're napping. Next up is the ocelot. He's napping too. You can just barely see him behind the tree trunk. Okay, this has to be the cutest thing we've seen. They're squirrel monkeys, but one of them has a little baby on its back. Hey, Daddy, come here. Aww. Aww. Right over here is the barred owl. I'm trying to look for the white-handed gibbon. They're really far back there hiding, but you can see them running around and playing. Here is a big cat. I think it's called a caracal, but if I'm mispronouncing that and you know better, then just tell me in the comment section below. Back here is a guanaco. These are in the same family as llamas and camels. <laughs> and if you're a regular Aiken Adventure viewer, then you know that we have a history with emus. I have PTSD from emus. Not good. He already looks like he wants to bite my hand off. This is the laughing kookaburra. We never knew why they were called that until we went to Carson Springs. This beautiful bird is called the Guinea Taraco. These are golden conures. Looks like they're having fun with some printer paper. This is a yellow crowned Amazon. And here's a gray parrot. Here's a red billed hornbill. And perched up there is a bald eagle. It's interesting, the coloration of his head isn't white like I would expect. Now I figure we'll just let Vivian finish out the day playing on the playground. And for even more great things that you could do all around the Gainesville area, click this video right here.